should be finishing soon. Okay, let's stop. We're short on time today, so we're going to go straight in. I want to make sure that we have enough time to cover all the questions, okay? So let's go over the answers first, starting with number one for Old Widow Lao. So make sure you come back to the first passage. I'm going to call out the answers, okay? One is dog. Two is boy. Three is boy. Four is A. Five is C. Six is A. Seven is C, 8 is C, 9 is boy, 10 is C. Okay? Next passage. 11 is dog, 12 is dog, 13 dog, 14 boy, 15 boy, 16 C, 17 A, 18 A, 19C, 20, dog. Okay, let's go to the final passage. 21, A, 22, boy, 23, dog, 24, A, 25, C, 26, boy, 27, A, 28, dog, 29, dog, 30, C, 31, boy. Okay, let's go back to the first passage now and go over explanations and mistakes that we have made. Okay? All right, back to number one. Questions on numbers one through six. Anyone? One through six only first. Number three, anyone before three? Two. Two? Anyone before two? Anyone on one? Oh, sure, wait, wait. Okay. What's on number three? One through six. One through six. Do you have a question on number one by chance? Oh, no. Okay, we're good. So number two first, okay? All right, so take a look up here. A main theme of the passage is that, for those of you who got number two wrong, what did you choose for number two? Who said they got number two wrong? All right, Taylor, what did you choose for number two? A. A, family relationships should be nurtured. So remember, we're looking for the best answer choice here, Taylor. All right, the best answer choice. Choice. Just because they allude to the fact that family relationships should be nurtured doesn't mean that it's the answer. We're looking for the main theme of the passage, right? So let's take a look at lines 50 to 51, and before doing so, look at the answer choice B. Quality is achieved. What is quality in Korean? Jin, right? Quality. Quality is achieved through deliberate effort. What does deliberate mean? Intentional, right? Look at lines 50 to 51. If we go up here, look at what it says. Jalen, okay? Can you read for me starting with you right here on line 50? What's it say? Exactly. You can never be an artist if your work comes without effort, right? And then after this, this just keeps going on about, look at this. That's the problem of modern ink from a bottle. They contrast the old ways of doing things, which talks about a lot of deliberate effort, with the recent way of doing things, which is just careless. Look, you don't have to think. You simply write what is swimming on the top of your brain, and on the top is nothing but pond scum, right? What is pond scum? Do any of you know? What's a pond, first of all? Pond? Little thing of what, right? It's like a mini lake. Scum? is all the bacteria and the dead stuff that's on top. So look at this. If you simply write what's swimming on the top, is that requiring effort? Is that deliberate? No, no effort. They're saying all you're gonna get is dead leaves and mosquito spawn. Got it, Jalen? Uh, but 
like this is the part of the paragraph, not a passage. So. Yes, it is part of the paragraph, but show me where you see family relationships are important. Where's the focus on family relationships? Like they talked about. Show me. Not they talked about, you need to find evidence. Because we remember, but what's actually in the passage is very different, isn't it? Okay? Good? All right. Let's keep going. Number three. Who said number three? All right. Feng Jun. Number three. Throughout the passage, the narrator is portrayed as someone who is, what do you choose for this one? A. A. Reserved around unfamiliar people. What does reserve mean? Reluctant? Reluctant? Perhaps for an action, reserved means you're reluctant to do it. But if you're reserved overall, it means that you're very calm, right? You're not willing to extend yourself. You're a little bit shy and you're careful, okay? Around unfamiliar people, we're not going to find that in the passage. Actually, look at line 22. And before we do so, look at what it says. Attuned to her immediate surroundings. What does attuned mean? Do you know what a radio is? I don't know if you guys know because you're so young, right? Um, we used to have these things called radios where you have the FM and the AM and you dial and you tune into something. Attuned means being aware of, okay? And where do we get that? Look at line 22. Let's go back here. Okay. It says right here, I tried to notice everything so I could later tell Gao Ling what I had seen and tease out her envy. And then in the first paragraph as well too, we notice that she's very attuned. Look, the narrator is the main character here, right? It was north facing, quite dim inside, and perhaps this was why father did not see us at first. Even though it's dim, he or she is aware of this, right? He was busy with the customer. The narrator is watching out for everything that's happening in her immediate surroundings. Okay, good. All right, anyone on number four? Me. All right, Mr. Kim, number four. Mm. What did you choose for number four? You uh, got it wrong. I chose C. C. Then, oh, pro, mm -hmm. then I got, uh, <coughs> but I chose number five as a, as a C. Mm -hmm. <coughs> but I cannot, ah. cannot find the answer from the line 15 to 18. OK, very interesting. Look at this. Mr. Kim chose the correct answer, right? Kim sang yeon chose C for 5, which is asking for evidence for this question above. So he got the proper lines here, but he got the actual question wrong here. So let's take a look at what's happening. You said that you chose C, and look at the question. It can be most reasonably inferred from the passage that old widow Lao's reluctance to stay for tea. So old widow Lao, the fact that she doesn't want to stay for tea, right? What is it? Is it appropriate because the shop is unusually busy? Well, it might seem that way, but let's take a look, a closer look. Before we do that, first of all, what does feigned mean? Do you know? Is a false. False. Faking it, right? Not faint, but feign, F-E-I-G-N, means to fake something, all right? And look at what it says. She is not genuinely firm in her resolve. What is resolve? <clears throat> Decision, right? She's not genuinely firm. And what does firm mean? Cool. Willing to go with it. She keeps changing it. All right? So we're going to find that. Look. Which line was it, Mr. Kim? 15 to 18. 15 to 18. Okay? Let's go back a little bit for context here. They rushed us to be seated at one of two tea tables for customers. Old widow Lao refused their invitation, what? Three times. Right? She refuses three times, exclaiming that my father and uncles must be too busy for visitors. Now, I know, Mr. Kim, you might be thinking, oh, how nice of her. It's appropriate. That's the right thing to do, right? They're busy, so they shouldn't stay for tea. But go on a little bit more and see what it said. She made what? Weak efforts to leave. Did she really intend on leaving? No. No. It, they're weak efforts to leave, okay? On the fourth insistent, we finally sat. I'm sad that you guys are missing this question because me, as an American, I can miss this question. Why? I'm gonna tell you a little story. When I first came to Korea, I started tutoring my mom's friend's son. And he said he was super hungry, right? Later on, but I didn't figure this out, I brought him like fatty baguette, right? And I had all this bread for him. And I, I told him, if you're hungry, go ahead and eat. And he's like, 
No, it's okay, I'm okay. And then after that, I just put the Paris baguette away. So all this bread and everything that I bought for him, I just put it in the kitchen. Later on, he, he told his mom, and then his mom told me what happened. She, my mom called me and said, Jamin, like, I heard something happened. And what she was telling me is that he's not supposed to accept the bread at first. In Korea, you're supposed to refuse. Ah, I need to right? It's okay, it's okay, right? And then you offer again. Oh, no, 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 really, really, it's okay. You offer again, right? This is exactly what's happening here, isn't it? Right? Keep in mind, this is a Chinese American family too, okay? So got it? Okay. So this should be a harder question for American students, not Korean students, okay? Are we good? All right, very good.